Catherine. And I'm Alejandro. And welcome to the Junior Mojo Talk Show. Today we'll be interviewing Junior Mojo's very own Noah Baum. Hi guys, so happy to be here. Noah, what is your job title here at Junior Mojo? I am the Junior Mojo Children's Programming Intern. That's my job title. How long have you been with the Junior Mojo team? Gosh, I guess I've been with the Junior Mojo team a little over a year now and I've loved every second of it. What do you do here? What do I do here? Geez, that is a big question. Well, what I do here is a little bit of everything. I host two of my very own shows. I host Noah's Impressions, where I do impressions and uh, my fellow Watch Mojo staffers have to guess which impressions I'm doing. I'm doing uh, Ask Anything, where I answer any question that might come into your head. Uh, I do a little bit of script writing, not even just script writing, I get to write my own songs that we perform here. I do a little bit of video editing and I do a little bit of B-roll too. B-roll, what's that? Well, B-roll, basically when you're watching a movie or you're watching a documentary or the news, it's basically the footage that appears over the talking. So it makes it a little more interesting, I guess, to look at. When you do Ask Anything videos, is the lab really there? Sorry, Alejandro, the, uh, the lab is not real. We actually make it in front of the green screen. Um, they basically just put me in there. It's like a model that they just kind of drop me into. So unfortunately, the lab is not a real place. Um, just to let you in on the behind the magic a little bit. What's your favorite part for working for Junior Mojo? Gosh, well, is it cliche to say that I love everything about working here? But if I had to pick one thing that I really like above all else, it would have to be being on camera and hosting videos. It's my favorite thing. Isn't it you guys' favorite thing? Yeah, yeah. sure it exactly. is. Exactly, there you go. Can I be on Noah's impressions? I'm sure I could guess all of them. You think you could guess all of them? All right, well, challenge accepted. We're gonna have to arrange that between you and me. Do you like celebrities? Do you like guessing voices? Uh, yeah, kind of. You think you'd be good at that? Yeah, sure. All right, well, you're gonna have to test your knowledge. We'll, we'll, we'll see you in an upcoming future episode and we'll put that to the test, okay? Okay, sure. All right, good. Over the first year of Junior Mojo, what has been the biggest change? I guess since I started with Junior Mojo, we used to do a lot of different types of shows and I guess that's kind of the thing that's changed the most. We do a lot more stuff like we've changed the true or false videos. So those are now interactive videos. So that's pretty cool. You get to play along with the video as it goes. Um, we have all kinds of new sketch shows. Like we've got uh, Pick Your Pop Star. I don't know if you guys remember that one, which uh, I played uh, Buzz, the lounge singer. So that was something that was really exciting for me. So really, I guess I would have to say the biggest change is just uh, all the new fun shows we're doing. That's uh, so much fun. It's super cool. After you finish university, what do you want to do as a career? Oh gosh, okay. Um, I guess what I want to do after I finish university is I've always wanted to move to Toronto and pursue a career in media making, whether it's broadcasting or directing movies or anything like that. You know, I just want to be involved um, with making stuff that's really cool for guys like you to watch. Doesn't that sound completely great? That actually sounds like a really good job. <sighs> See, this guy gets it. This guy gets it. Perfect. <laughs> awesome. We understand that you could beatbox. Yeah, it's pretty clear. Summer's a total drag. Can you teach us how? All right, okay, let's do a little, let's do a little demonstration. So watch. Watch what I'm doing, okay? So I'm gonna do a little. So it's all right here, right? It's all like in the front of your mouth. So you're making like B sound. So it's like a B, it's like a big B. Alejandro, you wanna give it a shot? Okay. There you go, see, you're kinda of getting, you wanna try, Catherine? Yeah. There you go, yeah. A lot of air, a lot of air coming out. So it's like, there you go. So oh, you might see. remember that. And so then you got the hi-hat sound. That's like the kind of you got one of those, right? So that's just, that's T-S. Say it right at the front of your mouth. You got, you go. All right, and then the last one, the last one comes from right down here. It's, it's uh, that's the snare. That's the snare in the drum set. So it's like, it's like from your throat, but it's also in the top of your mouth. It's, it's kind of a bunch of stuff. So Alejandro, give it a shot. Sure. There you go, we're getting it. So let's try and put those three things together. So let's do something real simple like, Alejandro? <laughs> amazing, you guys got it. You're on your path to becoming amazing beatboxers. That's it for us today. A big thanks to Noah Baum for being our first guest. We hope to see you next time. <laughs>